Now this is a fun little project. I uh, never thought of a snail being something funny to paint, but we were in France last year, and of course Dick had to have a escargot, and I laughed about it. But I think what we're going to do is we're going to paint him really colorful also. I've got, um, I'm going to do him in some blues and purple, so I'm going to come in and wet his, his neck area. I'm going to start out with the blue greens and then his, his shell. We're going to add some purples and maybe some blues. So I'm wetting the whole thing because I want this just to be real loose again and wet into wet. So we're having all these fun projects. Now he's on a, a, um, like a little branch that's been broken off. So it's going to add that much to that. So. Okay, let's go in and take a couple of paper towels. And I'm going to start out with this, with the, um, maybe the hooker's green at the top here. Drop in a little bit of that hooker's green. And let's see what we can do with that. And maybe a little bit of the yellow at the top. And this would be the lemon yellow. Let me pick up a little more of the lemon yellow. And drop in a little bit of that and come in. Let's add a little bit of the magnesium blue over on this side of him. It gives you a fun yellow, yellow green. And maybe we'll go down into more of the, the blue colors on this side of him to give him a little bit of a shadow area. Let's pick it up and let it run a little bit. Up into that gives him a little more dimension. And we'll pick up a little bit of this hooker's green. It's been mixed with the yellow right there. There's a little antenna. Okay, let's bring him back over into focus. Okay, let's bring in a little bit of purple down here below. And maybe a little bit of the And I'm going to do a little bit of splattering. A little bit of the green up here. Now as we're going into a shell, I think I'm going to make that a little more of the, the magnesium blue. Come in and bring that around here. And maybe we'll add a little bit of violet in there down below, just so those two colors can bleed into each other. And maybe a little more of the magnesium blue. Okay. Take a paper towel and blot some of those. So we'll pick him up, let him bleed down and run. And maybe spray a little bit of water. And maybe, maybe we'll use a little bit of the gray just to make this So I want this to be a little bit softer over here. So this edge here. And maybe we'll soften up some of this edge up in here. And pick it up and let it run. Because I want some of those lost edges. That's the fun part about painting this way. Maybe make it a little bit more blue. Bit 
Oops, I'm off camera. One more of the violet. Mm -hmm. stronger magnesium. I'm picking up and letting him run a little bit. Maybe block that a little bit. Pick it up and let it run. Let's bang it. So I think I'm going to let that dry, and we'll come back in and add a little more detail. Well, he's all nice and dry, so I'm going to come in and just do a little bit of detail. First of all, I'm going to separate. I'll do a little bit of the um, gray on the right-hand side there, a little bit of the ultramarine blue. Just want to separate that from... Um, from his body. So, not a lot, but I don't want it to be too much darker, but I want it to be where you can see these on, okay, then we're going to go in with the hooker's green and maybe add just a little more detail in his face area. Not a lot. Don't want to do a... So. Okay. Maybe add a little more of the magnesium blue in there just to make it a little bit stronger. Then we'll take some of the magnesium right out of the well and make a little bit stronger shape there so you can see the, um, and then just to give that, accentuate the, um, Maybe I'll come in with a little bit of the white and pick up a little bit of that and let that bleed and blend into some of the area up in here. It just gives an opaqueness to it. I love what that white's doing. And maybe we'll pick up a little more of the, the dark over here to accentuate the So that just kind of anchors him on that right side. Then pick up some more of this. Maybe a little bit of this. So I'm going to pick up a little more of the white. Maybe. stronger green. I 
I like the way the white comes in and adds a little variety. So this has been a fun project. I'm enjoying the experimentation. And let's add a little water to that. And then I'm going to pick up a little bit more of the blue, the magnesium blue, and maybe add a little more over here. And maybe even a little more of the magnesium up here at the top of this. So, just accents. Okay. Okay. So I'm helping it move along. Let's add a little bit more. Let's add a little more of the magnesium in here. This is a little bit of color. Yeah. Maybe a little bit of the green, the hooker's green. On this side, just a dot here or there. I'm calling finished.